Almost home. Well, the new home, I guess. And the sun is rising. Or is it going down? I can't even tell. Yeah, well. We've almost made it home. And with what I think is what I need to uh, start working on enchanting, which is exciting. But the problem is I don't have the experience, the XP, or the bookshelves necessary to get a full leveled experience, like, enchantment. I, I don't know. I don't know how I feel about this. Let's just make the thing and go from there. Enchanting table. I need four obsidian, a book, and two diamonds. And I believe I have, here's the obsidian. Put this name tag in. What else can I take away? A bunch of stuff. I got lots of pumpkin seeds. I forgot that I had that. Um, yeah, so obsidian and diamond. I'm going to put the two diamonds on either side. I'm going to get the four obsidian here, and then the final book. And here is my enchanting table. Now, I guess temporarily, I'm going to place it there just to see. And then, of course, I've got to have a lapis as well. But I guess the question is, what can I actually do? I can have smite and I can have smite. Smite one or smite one. Three lapis and three enchanting levels or one lapis and one enchanting level. I, What's the point? Why would I do this one when I can do this one? It sure would be nice to have smite. There we go. Okay, so I have smite. I'm at 16 levels now. What about... Okay, efficiency or unbreaking? Which one would I rather have? I would rather have Unbreaking, to be honest. Okay, and then... Projectile Protection, Protection, and Aqua Affinity. Hmm. Honestly... Projectile Protection. There we go. Oop. Because, you know... Ooh, I thought I, wait a minute, I thought I, oh, I, for one minute I thought that I had made diamond boots, but not quite. I, I had to have the diamonds to make the enchanting table. Okay, so, now, I guess the question needs to be asked, what now? What's next? Really can't do anything with all this stuff. Nope. Okay, put the rest of it in here. Wait, do I have any sticks? I actually don't have any sticks. Interesting. Oh, and I already had some chests. <laughs> Oops. Keep the string, though. I've got sticks here. Terracotta. Just got a whole bunch of random junk that I don't need. Yeah. Wait a minute, what? Where did I get nine diamonds? Oh, yes. I don't know where I got nine diamonds, but I'm going to take advantage. Oh, yes. The diamond chest plate. Oh, yes. And then if I kick over to... Oop, if I take some lapis, if I kick over to there... What do I get? Blast protection? That's it? Why? Okay, what if I used... What if I enchanted something else first? Hmm. No, I don't want to enchant any of this stuff. Well, still, having a diamond chest plate is going to be way better than having a regular iron chest plate, that's for sure. Alright, so I guess while I'm here and I've got the place lit up decently... What did I just hear? Some more baby sheep, I guess. I'm still waiting on all that over there to grow. But hey, baby sheep is good. And apparently that fox that was trying to kill my sheep last time, yesterday, or was it the day before? I don't even remember. Um, it's gone. Because for some reason, it was able to get to my sheep and damage my sheep, which was not okay. Yeah, I've got smite now, buddy. 
Why is it still taking so many hits? Four hits? Really? Ooh, that one only took two. Oh, maybe I just switched them up. So it's going to take two hits now to destroy zombies. That's awesome. That is truly awesome. Okay, what else can I do, I guess? Kind of slightly past midnight right now. Hmm. I can't believe I still have a stone axe. I guess I just don't use wood all that often. I don't know. It's it's really confusing. All right, so we'll put this diamond away and this golden apple away. Water bucket's always useful. I have definitely want to just make sure I keep plenty of coal on me as well. Let's make some sticks out of this different type of wood. There we go. Okay, and I got plenty of torches. All right, so we're set up. So now, honestly, honestly, I'm starting to wonder if maybe is that a kid? Is that a pig? That may be a pig. Oh, it is a pig, and that's a creeper. Haha. <laughs> I wonder if smite works on creepers. They're undead, aren't they? Three hits, not bad, not bad. Huh. Yeah, I'm starting to wonder. You know what, actually, I have an idea. I have a great idea, I think it's brilliant. My brilliant idea is I want to go to the nether. And I know, that does not sound like a great idea, especially in a world where everything wants to kill me and it's constant. Right, it just doesn't sound like a great plan. But if I am, if I manage to go to the Nether, then I could probably level up and get some better level enchantments. Of course, now that I've enchanted my stuff, wait a minute, wait. Now that I've already enchanted my stuff, I can't re-enchant it. I have to find, I have to enchant books, which is still doable. But then I have to get an anvil. But at least I know where lots of anvils are. So I think this is a good move. Dang, that took forever. I think this is a good move. I'm, I'm not too sure. How many of these do I need? I need... Uh, three, six, ten. I'm gonna need ten obsidian. This is taking so long. <laughs> this is taking forever. Oh well, at least there's nobody here but me. I'm the only one I'm boring, right? Oh well. At least I'm able to do this now. I feel like I've come so far. It's amazing. But yeah, so I actually go and I... find quartz in the nether. Right? And then, you know, within a, a couple of minutes, I've got loads of experience. And then I'm able to get better enchantments. And if I can get some better enchantments, then I'll be better equipped to take on you know, traveling and finally make it home, right? That is the whole point of all of this. The only thing I'm really missing, again, besides this nether that, or this uh, obsidian, which is taking four flippin' ever, the only thing that I'm missing then is... Oop, whoa. That was fast. The only thing that I'm missing then is, is, is cows, and I'm wondering if maybe I'm gonna need to set up a new home. Maybe I'm thinking, you know, Travel to that village. Ooh. I wonder. This used to be a lava pit, so I'm wondering if there may be diamond underneath this lava. Is that a thing? Is that a thing that happens? This is just me, right now, exploring a very dangerous place. That is lava. Okay. Nope, 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 nope. Okay. Well, I tested a theory, and I failed. <laughs> Alright, so I found my 10 obsidian, and now what I need to get is some flint and steel. Once I get some flint and steel, then I'll be able to, be able to go to the, the nether, and then, you know, during the daytime, I can be out here doing stuff, and then at night, I can go to the nether and be productive by getting levels. You know, I, I think that's a good way to do it okay flint and steel I think that I need here's some flint I don't know ah very nice okay now 
No reason why I can't just do it here. Okay. Just because I don't want to be wasteful, I'm going to use that on the corner. There we go. And light it up. Very nice. All right, so I now have access to the to the nether, which is fantastic. I think first though, I would like to um, I'm going to go over here and I'm going to look for cows because it's daylight. And then once it's not daylight anymore and it's not safe, I'm going to start going to the nether and I'm going to get some experience and who knows what else we'll find. I mean, we may be lucky and have just put the um, just put the portal right in the middle of, let's say, maybe like a fortress, right? And if we can find a fortress, then we can actually make some some potions. And, you know, there's nothing wrong with potions. That is a very helpful way to survive in this crazy world that I'm living in right now. But, of course, I have to find some nether wart. So, I mean, that's a thing. That's a problem. My kingdom for a cow... Oi. And actually, I'm noticing that there's no livestock whatsoever out here. Which is concerning. <laughs> but I'm thinking, hey, we got grass. We should be seeing animals. See, there's some chickens. Oh, I didn't bring any wheat. Oh, no. I didn't bring any wheat, but there's cows over here. All right, there's cows over here. This is... This is huge. This is massive. Okay. All right. I've got to get some wheat. I'm just running the most direct route that I can. And then I've got to take the long journey back and then with the wheat bring them back here and put them inside of the fence. I mean it's it's already past noon. I don't know if I have got time for this, but it's so worth it. The cows, that's the main thing that I've been missing. Is cows, is beef. It's not even necessarily because I want cows. It's because here I'm gonna actually probably easier to do it this way. Yeah, there we go. It's not necessarily because I want cows, it's because I want beef. That's it. That's the only reason. Oh, this is wonderful. But, oh, but there's no... What's up with my wheat? It's growing so slowly. I fed it all to my stupid sheep. And I've got a few of them that are growing, but not really. These aren't growing. It's like they're not... Well... There you go, buddy. Making sure that everybody's nice and moisturized. Maybe that'll help that grow a little better. Yep, so the sun is going to go down. I don't have any wheat, but I know that there's cows that direction. So eventually, I'll be able to get those cows and bring them here. And that may be a long, painful journey, but it'll be a journey worth taking. So I guess now, since the sun is going to start going down soon, you know what? I'm going to look over this hill one more time. Even if I find cows, I can't do anything about it. So what's the point? I don't know. I don't know. Are you like the lonely uh, pig out here? Are you like the only one? The lone survivor? Are you the lone survivor? Guys, I think I've just met the lone survivor. I guess the question is, who am I talking to? I've been alone for so long, I'm... Starting to lose my mind. All right. You know what? I'm going to put a few things away before I go into the nether because there's no telling what I'm going to find in here. So we're going to put away... I'll bring that, although I don't really necessarily need to light stuff up. Get rid of that. I don't need the water bucket because you can't use it in the nether anyway. Salmon, mutton, bread. I'm definitely going to bring the cobblestone though. Yep. Okay. Here we go. 
I got my sword ready. I should probably eat first. I can't believe that I found cows and I wasn't prepared for it. I'm supposed to always have wheat on me to be able to draw in the cows. I feel so dumb right now. All right, here we go. Oh, I'm getting sick. Okay, well. Place seems harmless enough. I don't know what this is necessarily. It's ash. Huh. That's funny. They called it it's it's an ash block. I'm literally I literally spawned on a block of ash, which is kind of hilarious, I guess. Maybe not hilarious, it's just interesting. Hmm. Okay, so the whole point that I'm here is to find some nether quartz. It looks like it may not be as common as I was expecting, which is a problem. Hello. Um, can I help you, sir? Just gonna make sure I don't hit him if I- Dude! Go away! Seriously? Just don't hit him. Just don't hit him. Just don't hit him. Okay. Why are you just staring at me like this? This is weird. It was like I got too close to him and he was just checking me out. Yeah, there's not near as much nether quartz here as I was expecting. And it's hard to get to some of this. This may not be the best strategy for gaining experience. Oh my. Nope. Nope, 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 Oh my goodness. Are you kidding me? What? I'm stuck in the- There's no way. I am stuck in the nether. I- I don't even know what to do now. I have no idea. There's no way for me to get iron or flint here in the nether. I am stuck here forever. And it's like this one doesn't even see me anymore. It's like... It's like it knows that it ruined my way home. And now... It can just do whatever it wants. And there's two of them! My goodness, this is insane. I don't know what to do now. I am completely lost. I can't believe that my nether portal was just deleted like that. Okay, I've heard this is how you do this. Come on. Come on. Gosh. I don't I can't I can't do this. I didn't come with a bow and arrow. I didn't come prepared at all. This is just terrible. I don't know what to do. I'm stuck in the nether. I'm gonna have to die here, and then that's what I have to do. I have to die here. I have to die here. That's the only way to get out of here, because then I'll, I'll, res I'll return to where I'm supposed to be. My stuff will still be here, and then I can come get it. Oh my goodness. <gasps> what? Go. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, come on, come on. It's like the fire from the ghast turned it back on. Oh my goodness, I thought I was gonna be stuck in there forever. Oh man, that was so stressful. That was so flippin' stressful. I am so glad to be home right now. Never ever again will I go to the nether without flint and steel and a bow and arrow. That is the last time ever. Oh my goodness. That was freaking crazy.